Venom Let There Be Carnage is a mere only three, close to three and a half weeks away from being released in theaters. And star of the film, Tom Hardy, confusingly gives us an answer on how his Sony universe is connected to Tom Holland's Spider-Man movies in the Spider-Verse. Tom really doesn't want to let the cat out of the bag and let us know that these films are related, but these movies are exactly related. But anyway, first what Tom Hardy tells Entertainment Tonight Canada. Tom Hardy says that there is a Venomverse, there's a Spider-Verse, there's a Multiverse, there's all kind of mythology to explore both literally and forward in time. I think with the right people and the right planning and feedback from the audience and understanding it's about making the right choices at the right time, even with foresight of understanding where things may go already or they wish to go. It's a combination of all those in the alchemy of what it will be. Now, that was just a really confusing or jumbled up piece of information that Tom really didn't want to let the cat out of the bag, like I said, about the movies being related. Now, this all has to do on how well, you know, of course, Venom Let There Be Carnage performs at the box office if we'll get to see more of, you know, Spider-Man interacting, Tom Holland's Spider-Man interacting with Tom Hardy's Venom. But if you didn't know, they did a screening most recently over in the UK about a day or two ago and a post credit scene, the, the details, the exact details of the post credit scene in Venom Let There Be Carnage was linked online. I'm not going to tell you exactly shot by shot and bit by bit what happens in the post credit scene, but what I will tell you is that Tom Holland's Spider-Man and Tom Hardy's Venoms, it's a lot of Toms right there, but they are linked and Tom Holland does make a, a quick appearance in this Venom film in the Let There Be Carnage in the post credit scene. So if you want all the details, you got to do the work and look it up and Google it for yourself. But that's just a little bit of information right there. If you didn't already know, it's going to be interesting to see how this is going to connect and what this might mean for future films for Venom and Spider-Man, Tom Holland, Spider-Man. And I do feel that this film will definitely be a success and it will succeed at the box office. It's a lot of projections and numbers being thrown around about what it could make on its opening weekend. My prediction is that this movie will probably make anywhere between 50 and probably like 65 million its first weekend, opening weekend. I think it's, you know, the anticipation is building, has been building, and is growing minute by minute, day by day. So I think this film is going to have a very big opening weekend. Feel free to leave me a comment in the comment section. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. This is AP, and as always, peace, blessings, and one love.